Zacharias P. Lovish Art Adventure Channel. I have a few things in this video. I'm really excited about the boat build is coming out well. This is the model. It's coming out really well. I'm really excited. Probably one of my more fun builds. I'm not in a rush this time. I'm usually in a rush. Not this time. I have some footage of the pigeon being attacked by a hawk. A hawk flew in the garage about this big. If you're into adventure, if you're into art, if you're into building boats, you might want to check out this video. Some people like the pigeon, some people like the boat. It's up to you. Check it out. I've gone ahead and drawn the bottom outline. It has two points and then it flares back out. I settled on an angle for the side of the boat. I sighted down the model and reproduced that angle you see right about there. Maybe a little bit more flare to it. I think I want it a little bit wider on the deck. The bottom of the boat, see the recurve I was talking about? And you will see that we'll meet the 2x2. Two two. This is actually the bottom. So that's right side up. And a 2x2 two two will be something like that. And that's why the recurve is important, because it meets right there. Base to the hole. I've got this all attached with glue and screws. These are the scoring lines. There are 38 scoring lines. It seemed like I needed more, but it does flex pretty well. I'll put this on my shoulder and push down. Flex, flexes quite a bit. The score lines, I may go about one third of the way through this bottom piece. Also, I'm using this. I grabbed it from a construction site garbage can. Probably somebody's cutting some kind of an arch for a house or something. And. This outline is the same as this, so kind of simplified, but um, I think it's going to work on the model it worked, so. Right, got those cut out. So that will be the curve of the boat this way. And there's that 15 degree angle again. So they'll both be kind of like this. So cut this middle piece, put it in there, secured it underneath with three screws. Got a 90 degree. Funny at this point, it looks pretty much the same way I started the model. Well, I guess I measured correctly because the whole boat is perfectly balanced on the middle. That's pretty cool. The weight distribution on either side is exactly the same weight, which is awesome. Good morning again, my bird friend.
The reason I went with this side piece as solid wood was so that I could have some kind of give in when I screw through it. It can push in a little bit and it can, there's more meat to deal with and when I sand it as well. You could potentially use a thin high quality plywood for the same piece right here, but you wouldn't have as much, I guess, uh, tolerance a roundish edge here that thinner plywood would give you more of a sharper edge because you wouldn't have as much wood to work with another one this guy's big too interesting this is crazy that is the birdhouse I built for the pigeon the pigeon is hiding in the corner and the hawk is sitting on the pigeon perch that is crazy. What a beautiful bird though. Like that perch. at six degrees, I believe, or seven. And angle there. It fits together like that in the front. That's your front, front of your boat, or back, the ends. Doing a view from inside the barrel again for somebody, a friend of mine, Joey, uh, from the same neighborhood I grew up in. Joey's the man. So shout out to Joey from San Diego. Uh, positive, super positive as it starts. This shape will also change drastically as I add the little spray and whatnot. Water droplets. Surf session. It should be small but fun. Let's check it out. 25 smiles per gallon.
There it is, almost ready for the sides. I think this will be the last clip in episode three. Before I start putting the sides on, I'll do that later in another video. But I like it. it looks really good. The lines look really clean and smooth. It's not too heavy. It'll gain weight, but it's not bad. Maybe I can go find some more birds. All right, there's a pigeon. Breakfast time. Out there. There's my pigeon. There she is. Hanging out. Stretching out. There you go. Stretch that out. Yeah. This pigeon doesn't really do any tricks yet. There we go. That's it. Sit. Stay. Good pigeon. <laughs>